Welcome back, everyone. Joining us now is Elise Charney, Emily Pilecchia, and Jesse McFarland, who are, these two are the lead roles in the Ramsey Theatre Company's inaugural production of Beauty and the Beast, and we also have the director alongside us. Thank you all so much for being here today. I of know it's course. A, it's an exciting time here in the theatre world. Uh, kind of tell us uh, about uh, the Ramsey Theatre Company. Just, uh, I know this is the inaugural production, so kind of tell me, uh, why, why uh, Beauty and the Beast? Sure. Well, Ramsey Theatre Company is Skypac's first semi-professional uh, theatre company here in Bowling Green. Uh, and why Beauty and the Beast? Because it's a tale as old as time, right, of right. course. That's true. That's true. <laughs> well, it hits, it hits all the ages, and so we wanted something coming out of the gate strong with something family-friendly. Definitely. All right. So, Emily, uh, Jesse, I know you guys are playing the main lead roles. Yes. Uh, so, kind of tell me, what kind of got each of you both into theatre uh, in the first place? Um, well... So I was in sixth grade when I went to see Aladdin on Broadway. All right. Um, and I, at that point, I had seen I'd seen a few productions on Broadway, but for some reason, when I left this one, I was crying, and I don't know why, because it's a happy <laughs> it's a happy show. Right, right. Um, but I found that I was just so moved by it. Um, and, I, and, and as soon as I walked out of the theater, I was like, oh, I think that's that's what I want to do. Definitely. So yeah. Uh, so this is, I love answering this question because uh, <laughs> it involves my mom. Uh, so when I was in eighth grade, I was, I was really big into sports and like football yeah. and that was, that, was my, that was my goal, that was my path. Right. Uh, and then I got to where I was trying to pick my elective one, one year in eighth mm -hmm. grade and my mom was like, you should try theater. And I was like, mom, come on. Like, I want to do theater. <laughs> and then, and, Don't embarrass me here. And then, <laughs> right. But it was uh, the first show I, I got cast, and, and it was, it was, it was eye-opening. I was like, okay, I can yeah. do both. I can enjoy both. I can have a great time doing both. And then it kind of just, from there, I, 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 I went into doing theater for, for what was my passion rather than football. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Um, and did, did each of you go to school for, you know, not really film, but I mean, well, technically film, but uh, for theater and just acting in general? Yeah, so I'm actually, I'm attending Syracuse University okay. right now, yeah. and my major is musical theater. All right, yeah. sweet. sweet. Yeah, I, I, I went to Northwestern State University in right. Louisiana and did uh, uh, majored in performance and directing. And Elise, what kind of got you into the, the director side instead of, uh, did you ever do any uh, theater production yourself? Yes, I, I was on the other side of the table as it, as it would be uh, up until after I graduated college. I went to Marymount Manhattan College in New York for performing. Um, but being in that atmosphere, being up there with the big dogs, I realized, yeah, no, not so much. <laughs> I definitely have always loved being on the stage, but I, I definitely realized that my type A personality is more for the organization of the theater and the directing process, and I can still feel completely fulfilled by being um, on this side of the table. Definitely. Yeah. And uh, with this upcoming play, kind of tell me, uh, where, where can people, uh, I understand, Tickets are sold out, right? Yes. Yes. So uh, if they cannot attend the show, what what's the what's the goal for them to you know maybe return tickets or you know what's the what's the exactly. next exactly if they if they aren't able to attend they can just bring back those tickets to the ticket office at Skypack um, and they'll uh, do a return and then that way those seats are available for someone else to attend. Oh, yeah. Okay. Awesome. Well, um, that it sure to be a fun show. Like you said, it's a tale as old as time. Uh, thank you guys so much for being here uh, and for more information on upcoming events you can visit the skypack or you can visit the skypack's website skypack.com or you can call 270-904-1880 we'll be right back